Fan meter has been dominant all season long, but today they face their toughest challenge yet going up against the top seed in Class 2A, Central Lion George Little Rock with the state title on the line. Local 5's Jake Brent has more from Cedar Falls. Van Meter was the top dog in Class 1A, winning titles in 21 and 22, but now they're up in Class 2A, looking to join rare territory, winning back-to-back -back titles while moving up a class. Taking on number one Central Lion George Little Rock, both teams 12 and 0. Van Meter down 7-3 in the second quarter. Austin Baumhover barrels in for the score. The Bulldogs go up 10-7. The Lions come right on back. Reese Vanderzee lofts for Matthew Deeren right in the breadbasket. Van Meter trailed 14 to 10, and now 21 to 10 in the third quarter. Van Meter knocking on the door, and they use some trickery. A double reverse ends up back with Baumhover finding Porter Dodgett. Deficit down to 21-17. Same score, nearly the same spot. This time the reverse is just a reverse. Caleb Moore weaves in from nine yards out. Dogs go up 24-21 with the two-point conversion. Fourth down for Central Lion. Eight seconds left going for the win, and the snap timing is off. Van Meter wins with their backs against the wall, and the three-peat is complete. We went down 21-10, and it was just staying in the moment and fighting. Um, that's kind of been what's What's been the mindset for us the whole season is never giving up, no matter what. Coaches say don't blink, and I think the team that deals with the most adversity wins. So I think we all stuck our heads down, didn't blink, and kept going. You know, I always think of all these guys as, as an extended family and his sons, obviously, and they're going to do great things uh, beyond football uh, as fathers and uh, brothers and uncles. How about them? What a game. Reyna, I'm going to send it back to you because I hear we've got another team going for a three-peat. It's Southeast Polk in Ankeny.